briefly touched on this in the first of these videos, I'm just going to look at FM again. I made some FM style sounds with the LFO, but didn't really explain what I was doing. So to get those sort of FM sounds, those sort of bellish sounds, you need some really fast modulation, which the LFO can give you, because it does go into audio rate. So just by whacking this up, and here I'm modulating the VCF. And that's, I mean, that's really simple, and that's how you get those sort of really weird, crazy sounds. But you'll notice the modulation sounds different on every note. On some, it sounds almost harmonic. And that's when the LFO is oscillating at a similar sort of frequency or a harmonic frequency of, of the oscillator. So to get the LFO to sound similar across a, a range of keys, we need to send the keyboard CV out into the LFO rating. And then it'll track the keyboard better. It's not perfect, but it's pretty good. As I said in the, I think it was the first video, over, the fir over a few keys it works really well, over a couple of octaves it doesn't. So if we now tune the LFO to one of these keys, it's quite close that. It's starting to sound similar across a lot of them. Which makes the sound of the FM style sounds more usable in a track. So you can then start making them a bit more discordant. But you're going to get a similar sort of discordant sound across all the keys. Bring in a bit of PWM as well. Or as I've just done there, modulate the frequency of the oscillator. But the more you start modulating, the more mad you get. But let's just compare what we've done there. So if we take out this, I mean, there's nothing wrong with that, if that but but it just makes it a little bit more trackable and a bit more consistent across your across your sequences I mean I'm playing all this really quickly and roughly here but let's play around with it a little bit more on the oscillator frequency As the modulation's bipolar, it'll modulate above and below the note, so you can get some really discordant sounds. And then if you can tune it into playing an octave below and an octave above, you can get really quite tuneful sounds. So FM's a really nice way of adding some richness, but also some mad discordance or bell-like tones. Hope that was of some use to somebody somewhere. See you next time.